of course, is Veterans Day, a time to honor the brave men and women who have served our country. And a local nonprofit is showing its gratitude by setting the table for a warm meal and some goodwill. Our Eddie Kadem with more on how Chosen 300 Ministries made our veterans in need feel very at home tonight. Sadly, one-fifth of the homeless population in Philadelphia are veterans, so tonight is about giving them some hope and resources to change those statistics. The alarming rate of veterans who are homeless or in need is an issue that Brian Jenkins knows all too well. My brother, who served in the Navy for 20 years, um, he got out of the Navy, retired, and a year later he died. And the reason for his death is because he just could not access health services. That loss drove Jenkins to make sure others know they're appreciated and supported with his organization, Chosen 300 Ministries. We not only provide meals, but we do job training, computer labs, we have expungement services. So if a person has a record, we can get their record clean so they become employable. Uh, we have health clinics, we have barber shops. We do a lot of things to help people not only get food, but also move towards self-sufficiency. Chosen 300 Ministries has been giving back for over 20 years. And every Veterans Day weekend, they bring in our heroes in need for a night of food, and fellowship. So a whole lot of guys that are suffering from the mental um, support and uh, the, just the different challenges that you go through. You know, it can be very stressful for everybody. So it's nice when people want to reach out and they want to help you. A dinner and a helping hand for our hometown heroes who so often are forgotten. It saves me, you know, because I don't have all the time. So I come here all the time. Yeah, and it helps me a lot. Chosen 300 provides more than 150,000 meals to veterans around the area, and they have global locations as well. They are a nonprofit, so they could use some help and volunteers. If you're interested in that, head to chosen300.org. In Spring Garden, Eddie Kadem, Fox 29 News.